So yes, finally, finally, finally. So of course I'm back on a really, really quick, of course, of course, progress. Let Dokken Battle video. So of course we actually got a lot of new news in here for Dokken uh, recently. So we got just a whole bunch of just new stuff here from the Dokken now. Originally I was going to make this into its own separate video. But like, nah, there's no point. I might as well make it into one video. Because, um, yeah, making separate videos because it's just simple and easy. Um, you know, it gives me time to do stuff. Because, yeah, I tried to record it. Again, this year is just crazy. Because last year I got to record every video right on time. Everything was out on time. Everything was perfect. And now this year, now everything's just off sync, off balance. So, like, I'm behind. But also, I want to be caught up with everything. It's just, man, life really sometimes can just get crazy and busy. And trust me, it happens. So, but yeah, of course, we got the new banners, though, of course. They are out already, ready to go. I was like, you know what? I'm going to make, yeah, because um, by the time I was trying to get the Asus video done, it was like already 20 minutes. So, I'm like, yeah, if I, it would have been like 30, 40 minutes if I literally just went over everything. So, yeah, we got a lot of new stuff in here. And a lot of, the, probably one of the biggest news is in Dokken history. Like, out of everything in Dokken, this might be the biggest celebration ever. We got so much new stuff revealed. So much new everything though, of course, like I said, the bear is gonna go over that last. That'll be the last thing I'll go over. Again, just so much stuff in here. It's crazy right now, and I love it. It's just utterly insane how crazy right now Duck is. So of course we got the banners up. We got um new EZS coming up. We got Transforming Trunks, Everyone Zamasu, Int Mai, Zamasu, and Kawas, Kawas and Zamasu. That'll, that'll be probably its own EZA, so for like probably some little units or something like that. But yeah, like I said, stuff might change, it might be different later or the beginning of now and everything. You hear all the noise outside. Sorry about that. Construction workers still in my neighborhood. I guess been almost like almost like a month now. So, uh, sorry about that. Though. I can't help that at all. But yeah, uh, we got all that new coming from the Dokken now. Again, I'm gonna go for some of the JP live stream, live stream, live stream, the JP live stream stuff as well because I didn't originally go over it when it that first. No, 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 no. I might as well just make that until you know one video because um, um, yeah. Make that, um, I'm trying to think, JP last stuff, make that into, is make that, I originally was going to make it into its own video, but I was like, I might as well just go over in here, because it's pretty much the same stuff from, it's just a Dokken now, just, you know, last year, I mean, it's ever for J, Gold Boy and JP, same stuff, whatever, just, yeah, whatever, same stuff for Gold Boy and JP, that's what I meant to say. I'll probably like another, some more Boy EZA, um, event that you had to do, so, that probably won't take too, too long to get done or whatever, though, so that's not bad, though, not bad. Oh, what else do we have it here? We got all the cards for Blue Goku and Blue Vegeta. Uh, go that go to Vegito. Yeah, we got four new card arts. That's insane. But yeah, again, that's when they first um pretty much block um uh, be the shield for Kawasu and um Supreme Kai. Then of course that's them charging at Merzamasu. This is them of course um about to charge at Merzamasu again and go to Vegeta, which again own original Doken card art looks amazing. Again, it just looks good. So then goes for Zamasu though, he has him powering up, throwing a mixtape attack at um everybody calls it the mixtape attack. I don't know why. All his, all his cards look amazing though, it's insane. Um, it's him throwing the Vegeta, um, his, um, Divine, uh, I don't know, I don't know, D Divine Mixtape, I call it that, his Mixtape Attack, because it's really a fireball, people call it the Mixtape Attack, he does that as, a, um, the Vegito, that of course that's him literally standing against Vegito, like powering up, then he goes, Divine Infinite Zamasu, all his cards are really good, like, these probably are some of the best ones in Dokken, because, and the blues, they always make the ores so good, like, it's, man, it's, it's layout time now, boy. It's layout time, and I got a whole bunch of new ideas. So that's really exciting, and I'm happy for that. Though. That's going to be really, really good. What else do we have here? Oh, yeah, new Link Level event. So it's pretty much the um, equivalent of, you know, last year we had the cooler um, Link Level event. Uh, a few years that before, I think we had, like, the King Kai one, or Guru. Um, we had, like, two new Link Level events last year, but they brought back the Guru one, of course, making sense with Namek. And, of course, they brought a brand new one. I was like, please bring a brand new one. This is from the JP live stream. Like I said, Goldman JP do share similar stuff with their, again, live stream and Dokken now aren't, I say, you technically are the same thing, but not really. You won't go that far, though, but, I mean, hey, whatever's whatever. I believe what you want to believe in. Um, but, yeah, like, um, that's pretty much what we're going to have here. And I actually do like it, so, again, another new Link Level event, I'll take it. Again, more than levels are better though. Again, so many use I got so much of my units level ten, and, and it, it's crazy. It's crazy. And of course, we got the um, this old free play drunk to find getting uh, awakening. Well, actually, the card looks really, really good. Actually, oh, let me zoom in. I never got to really zoom in. That just looks really, really good. That means Ray Trunks does have a formal super attack. And again, like I said, it's gonna be the go with the stick effect, easy A, and everything. Okay, he's gonna get the easy A. It's obvious so Um, but yeah. Um, but he'll probably be really good though again before he awaken that right I mean not everybody used to but when he first came out though And again, like, this, like I said, this guy's gonna be a dog fest at some point in the game now that I think about it Yeah, cuz we don't we don't have a rage. We haven't had a rage trunks in like um, 
besides what transforming tech trunks technically if you want to go that far but it was spare bone sword trunks I don't know well, we could get this guys at carnival part 2 LR um, I don't know there's so much part 2 like new Goku black this guy sword trunks I don't know so many so much possibilities for a part 2 LR it's crazy it's crazy like Rose that goes you know you know just because they have the intro like where he, um, Goku Black first shows up and you know him going Super Saiyan and everything because like, we still don't have those animations in Doken at all and those are going to be insane for the part 2 carnival again part 2 seems like it's going to be carnivals um they watch be like oh yeah Doku Fest in the carnival I'm just kidding I like how the anniversary did both of part 1 was the old Doku Fest part 2 was the carnival last year I think it was a lot more better if they had it formatted well no it was formatted pretty well we had part 1 with the Doken Fest barriers that sucked last year though for Donald Celebration those were easily the worst ones out of everything in Doken right now but yeah that was um part 1 was cooler then, um, of course, we're saying Goku. No, part one was cooler than Goku. Goku was Carnival. Part two was Doken Vest. Uh, Goku Vegeta, then Carnival was cooler. Again, switching it up a little bit. Which isn't that bad, though. I still love the Carnivals, but like I said, um, part two and stuff like this could be like that. Again, part two Carnivals, don't, you really don't need to summon on it. Again, you're going to get a whole bunch of LRs from it just because the rates are, on those are double rates on crack. But, yeah. Just saying. That's going to be insane right there, though. A lot of new summoning animation, of course, when Goku goes super. It looks like Buchi Kiri match inspired, though. That's when he goes Super Saiyan. Uh, we got base form Vegeta Blue transformation. Of course, Vegeta Blue transformation. Um, we got or the new, yeah, new Vegeta pose. That's literally from the tech pose. Super Saiyan three Goku. I guess like when he fought like sparring mats against Trunks. It looked like Kaioken Blue. Yeah, we got Super Saiyan one, a new Super Saiyan one, a new Super Saiyan two, a new Super Saiyan three. Uh, Blue Goku. I think a new Sky graphic too. Yeah, the Trunks going back in time. I think that's a Wii we, a we animation. Uh, we got Sword Trunks. Sword Hope Trunks. We got um. My trunks leaving for the future. Um, I have a full breakdown for this and everything though, right here. So um, it should be. Was it this one? Yeah, right here. It's right here. Okay. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, that's the cool village. Bye, guys. You know, trunks slash of Masu. Yeah, leaving for the future. Yeah, double cast screen. Future LR. Not yet. Acquire in the box. Or you know, two future Doka Fest. Uh, oh, okay, so it seems like trunks alone, I guess, equals the um, time machine. Of course, blue means like Vegeta. Probably guaranteed. Yeah, it's guaranteed LR probably. Um, Again, just so much like the breakdown. Where, again, new summoning animation is always good. I didn't really get to break over the last ones from the superhero one, but you know, having celebration themed um, animation is really good. Hopefully, they'll bring these back. I wonder if heroes will get one. That's gonna be insane. Then I'll be like Galaga Vegeta, Hakai Beerus as like a pull down animation. That's gonna be insane. Of course, get the banners live right here and stuff like that. Though I haven't really seen them that much though, but they are pretty good. Of course, you get um, the buy three get one free for like. 16 15 days from the time of recording, you got ticket A and B for um global, which is really weird because I don't think JP got tickets now that I'm hearing of, but yeah, we got the part um ticket, ticket A and B. Of course, we some on these banners, you'll get a random uh, tickets. I think it's like three or up to three to ten tickets you get at a time. I think it's three, six, seven. I don't know, it's always random. And you can, um, it, it explains it in the game, but yo, know, you get tickets as you summon on these two regular banners, you'll get tickets. For these, not the only free multis, but yeah, you can get, um, if you get tickets from these, then you can use a ticket to summon on these if you want to. Like I said, you have a pretty much a Omega quadruple chance of getting these, um, units. So I don't really think the banners, like I said, that much though, but I am gonna. Oh, yeah, do some animations. I still have them in here. Is this the first one? Or was this the first one? From the Doka now that I explained. I think it's this one. Was this one or was it this one? I believe. I think it might have been this one. Yeah, this is the new one. I think it's just pretty much like Trunks alone. I guess him going to the future or we so we ride. I don't know. I couldn't tell. It was weird. I think this trunk's just alone. Is that blue Goku? Oh no, Vegito. Okay. Very similar to the new Goku pose too. So we got that. Is that pretty much it? Yeah, Goku Black. I think this. I think they had a new one in here. I felt like they did. I guess not. I thought they did at least. Maybe it's this one I'm thinking of. It might be this one I'm thinking of. Yeah, this is based on Vegito. Which looks really, really weird. Yep, the other blue Vegito. What else do we have in here? There's just some of the animation thing. Yeah, there's new Goku. Super Saiyan. They got what, Super Saiyan 2? Of course, three games. This is, uh, it just goes through all of them, though, so that's why. Yeah, Super Saiyan 3. I know Blue's up here too. I don't think there's a God Animation one. I think that's um, Goku and Trunks fighting in the um, little bubble space that Boba makes for them. I think that's it. Trunks um, fights against Goku just comparing him to Black and everything. Yeah, there's Blue. 
If it's not Luke Hyde, I think that's a similar mold for the original animation that they had. I think this one's just the Bye Guys. But yeah. But that blue one is new, though. I, think, I don't think it's old. Okay, yeah, I just gotta go though. Yeah, Long Coming Meha was the main ones. That's why I think this is a guaranteed feature unit, though. Again, similar, same animation, like, meanings, just, you know, just a longer animation with the character. Because I know that's featured. Long animation means featured. If it stalls, it lags out a little bit, even though it's pretty much lagging in a nutshell. But, yeah. Very, very similar. Yeah, just the first crack screen. Yeah, just the second one. This is like your Dragon Balls. Like, in this pretty much example, it'll be like, oh, yeah, you know, sorry for drugs means goodbye, guys. Yo. Almost panties. Yeah, the puff puff. Yep, trunks of my looking for the future. That's cool. That's equivalent to that. Yeah, it's just the flashing animations that they're using. Okay, yeah. I think we do the animations on here too. Yeah, from the Dokken. I think this is all like the new summoning anima new animations from the um. Yeah, these are just all the new animations that we got from um. Uh, what you call it? Yeah, these are just all okay. These are just all the summoning animations. Um, not gonna really spend too much time on that, actually. Yeah, probably won't actually. Yeah, because I really don't need to waste time on that though. Uh, this, yeah, these are just all the animations I just have pulled up though. I think what, what else is in here? Oh yeah, the banners. I didn't really go over them and look at them though. They're actually really good though. I think these might legit be the best banners in Dokken because are they? I know. Yeah, Fuji Gohan Trunks. Probably the bottom of the barrel for the list. Frieza's good. Sales good. I'm glad he's back. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah, I look at the Tech Gods, I'm like, what the world? Cooler? Like, these two in the same banner? That's insane. Uh, yeah, you got Beast on here. You got Tech Goku, which is really good. Of course, Maya, Blue Goku, and Vegeta. Then this one, you got, like, what? Nimi Goku, Triple Nimi Goku, Black Nimasu. What? Uh, yeah, the Super Saiyan 4s. Oh, yeah, these got some Black they're, they're good. Tech oh, yeah, these banners, are, yeah, these banners are crazy. Yeah, they're good. I can't say which one's better. They're both equal on the equal value of good. Like, the gods and cooler are one better. And Tank Goku 2 and Full Power Freeze and Trip from Excel. Then I got to here. I was like, wait, wait, wait. They got Piccolo, the god. They got Orange Piccolo, which actually is a good tank. You got these guys on. You got these guys. Oh, he gets easy A. Yeah. These two getting easy A's. That's going to be insane. And probably the biggest announcement ever from just this overall. It did, they did mention the international version, which means pretty much global. And JP are being synced up. I'm not joking. I'm literally not even joking. Gold and JP are being synced up. I'm not joking. Gold and JP are uniting and just uh, and just coming together and being on the same schedule, which is good. I'll be like, oh yeah, for years, then I could do it. The tickets might go away. I mean, they can just implement it on, on both versions now, which is good. I like that though. So Gold and JP can be caught up on the same schedule. I love that because for Dark Fest events, it means we don't have to be behind. I can keep everything on schedule at one point. It's gonna make everything so much easier. I'll be like, oh, it's gonna be so bad and everything. Uh, but like I said, it's not gonna be immediate because we don't know just yet. They mentioned that we don't know yet. But um, yeah, again, we don't know just yet though. I know they also mentioned Koda was like stepping down. I think. I got. Give me a sec. I know I, I have a screenshot somewhere. Give me a minute. Okay, I found it. I had to lose it. So, yeah, I did find this on, um, was it Hypes or Pro? Yeah, it was Pro. Okay. Yeah, he did mention it. It says, virtually, we aren't going to um, lose Coda because it says, right now, we decided that the main um, producer, um, oh, sh oh, I don't know, I got to try to pronounce that. Again, I can pronounce it, but right now, my brain's not, like, <laughs> I just don't want to try it. We'll be hosting the video, video starting for the next one, which is, yeah, a little sad that we're losing Coda. I'm sorry, man. Coda was so awesome. Like, why can't they just, I mean, she's probably not fire or anything, but. She, they're going to the videos instead of her. But again, she should come back. I mean, she's going to probably make cameo appearances and come back and stuff like that. But Koda, ever since she took over, has been amazing, and I love her. I miss Koda, no, my girl. But yeah, though, uh, Gold Boy JP, yeah, being synced up at the same time. What do you guys think about that, though? I like it. I think it's a good idea and a good decision because, hey, it was about the time in Legends of JP and Gold Boy on the same track. Why not mix up with this one, too? So that's good, though. I'm finally glad to catch up Gold Boy JP on the same schedule. Because oh, well, right now, at times recording, only missing the Tana body units, the Goku and Omega, Super Trunks. I think that's pretty much it. And Turles and Spare Bomb Goku. Otherwise, yeah, like, what is the point? At some point, I was like, yeah, they're going to stick up the games because Gold Bull was, like, right there. I know, I'll be like, oh, yeah, it's been months. They're not going to ever do it ever. Like, yeah, with this confirmation, again, we don't know just yet, though, but when we know, though, we're going to know because Gold and JP are on the same version updates. We're behind a few world tournaments and the other little units and stuff like that, though. But, I mean, hey. 
They can shove them in there. I mean, they always do it, no matter what. You know, Goldman JP getting part two together. Goldman JP getting tickets together. Again, they yeah, some stuff might be lost. Some stuff might be gained. But again, everything not 100%. We don't even know that, though. But yeah, that's pretty much everything from the Doka now. So JP live stream I went over. A lot of new stuff here. A lot of new information. A lot of new just good everything overall, though, and I like it. But yeah, though, see you guys there, though. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Great life. I'll go to the end of the Stay safe. Watch your hands. Go bless all people going up. And over mass. Don't tell people to read to. Best if you can. Go outside to some guys. And come to your friends. And do it. Go social. If you don't wear it. Because they're awesome. What I got to think about is all simple, though. Of course, I hate it. I hate it. Again, very simple. Very easy. Like I said, though. But I'm excited, though. Of course, everything's coming up. Goldman JP. This is easily the best celebration in Dokken. I don't need to say anymore. See you guys later though again though. Peace out.